Hey everyone, Andrew, Park Rovers, and we are at Bush Gardens Tampa Bay, and we are going on the Serengeti Safari. The Serengeti Safari is a 30 minute standing room only tour on the Serengeti Plains here at Bush Gardens Tampa Bay. And I picked up my reservation here at the Serengeti Outpost. I actually didn't have to pay a thing because I get in free as a Busch Gardens Williamsburg Platinum member. Tickets for the Safari are $39.99. If you're a past member, I think you also save 20%. Here is the waiting area for the Safari. You actually also have drinking water available to you with some paper cups. Safaris run every 30 minutes and you check in 10 minutes before. All right, it is time for our Safari. Uh, North Carolina. Apparently we also have Matt. I should introduce him too. <laughs> Hi guys. Hey Matt. This is Matt. Hey, Matt. He, so you, you feel free to interrupt him too. Okay, everyone hang on tight. We are good, Justin. Kind of look like deer to you guys. Yeah, a lot of put them, people put them in the Tragilophus genus, which means goat-like stag or goat-like deer. So it's kind of interesting. But kind of look like deer. Look off to your left, you'll see an African crane. <laughs> <laughs> Some of them might look like a little orange to you. That's because they 
probably been rolling around some mud or there's already some clay out over here. Um, but they're essentially almost like gray to dark gray. Um, it was a mistranslation of the word night, which means white lips, but it got translated, mistranslated into um, what they thought white, which is where they get their name white. Now we're going to be going back to our cell phone where our giraffes are, and we're going to get a little closer to them as well as we get to feed them. Yeah, that's Rube Rube's hanging out over here. That's going to be Ruby. Um, she's our smallest girl out here. She's eyeing us. <laughs> we'll see if we stop. I don't know. So if they decide to come up, I have that lettuce that it's going to be like a watery, crunchy, tasty treat. It's like their ice cream for them, just without any calories. Oh my goodness. So, like I said, this is Ruby. She's, oh, you have a bunch of little seeds all over your face. So you can just hold it up and out and she will take it right out of your hand. Feel free to take those photos of you. Feed Ruby. Oh no. So we have one of our babies <laughs> that is Beacon. We're surrounded. But this little guy, he actually, you can actually feed him. So you're more than welcome to feed the little fella. Or, okay. Shik well, I guess Shikari decided to go away. Um, but you can feed Beacon. Feed Beacon. No, one well, way we can tell them all of our it looks like Bernie might be joining us. He's going to be our Bernie. tallest or not. He's our tallest member of the family. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. You go. Oh, Beacon. Wow. Oh my goodness. Looks like hey, Ruby. She's our smallest, like I said in the beginning. She also has a giant um, kind of bump on her head, also known as an ossicone. So, do I have a brave volunteer? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. So, you're going to go up to Ruby, you're going to put your hands in the, uh, like a bowl formation, like this. Awesome. And you're going to give that to her bowl style. That is also oh. known as our slobber method. You don't have to make it super tiny, you can just kind of make it a little bit crumbly. And they love it. There's a good giraffe, right Behind there. the back. All right, Rubes. This is it. That's all I have. <laughs> oh, no. The wind took it. Awesome. Just don't oh, just put your hands up in the air. Just let them know we don't have any more food. Okay, hang on tight. And then hang on tight. Okay. No more food. Hang on tight. Well, that was an awesome safari. I actually didn't expect that we'd stop at the giraffes for so long. We must have been there for about five, five to 10 minutes feeding the giraffes. That was really cool. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to Park Rovers, and we will see you next time.